Hello YouTube. Today on Zero MXP95 AV is going to be reviewing the probably around the most popular antivirus out there on AVG Antivirus Free Edition. Okay. As you just saw, update completed successfully. Everything is active. Um, I'm gonna jump right into it. All the um settings are all stock, so. Like normal people, they'll just install it and they'll think it's ready to go. So that's what we're going to assume here. We'll pull up our links. Got a lot of them here. And if I haven't explained how they are set up before, these are um, off page zero on malware domain list. These are most zero day. Maybe one or two of them are from yesterday. These are more from the first page or page zero. And then these down here are a couple off of the second page just in case all of these fail. And we just got something. So hopefully 10 out of all these will work is the goal. Alright. So the first thing we're going to do here is start up Internet Explorer. And I'm running Windows 7. As you can see. So we will start here. And give me one second as I'm going to turn off my antivirus or else it will interfere. Okay, I said to turn off my Norton 360 or else it does interfere with the links. So, I'm not going to scan the computer and we will start right now. Okay. Well, let's see. Let's see what happens here. It doesn't do anything. All right. So caught the first one there. Okay. Move. Oh. Okay. Well, it did catch it. So it seems like this one here may have gotten through. So let's see here. Ah. Okay, so one is down. Hate it. Whenever I get one that's down, then the rest of them are all down. Yeah, I guess we got a lucky day here. Okay. Oh. Let's see if it'll still. Okay. So I don't want to restart. That one I'll take is down. Ooh. Okay. 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 Simple. I fun. Right. Well, it seems like it's actually doing not that bad. And four. So we need four down here. Work.
Well, I knew there was four. Come on. Mm -hmm. Alright, well, not having much luck with these here. One of them works here. Alright. Well, we got one. Okay, okay, whatever. Alright, so there's two. Okay. 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 Two of these need torque, hopefully, here. Whenever you do get a virus, so these are like really, like you get two pop-ups for everything that you get. It's really annoying. So, it is like, if I can find one more here that it'll catch. Maybe. And just one more. Alright. Well, it finally does catch it. Like, you get one here, and then it, like, comes up with the second. I don't know. It's really. I like how it's, like, action is unsuccessful and all that crap. But, so we got 10 links. That was actually really lucky. 10 out of all those work. So what I'm going to do now is I'm going to pause the video and I'm going to scan it with AVG and all my other little tools that I got. And we will see how many it is once I come back. Alright, I'm back. And, um, well, AVG did pop up, um, while, like, it was scanning, or right before it was scanning, saying that it found a password stealer or something, I removed that. And then after that, no infections were found from AVG. Did I say McAfee? Why am I AVG if I did? My head hurts. Alright. But yeah. <coughs> AVG did not find anything. Malwarebytes found this registry key. Um, I don't think it's a big thing at all. Just registry key. Um, okay. This actually, I think, found pretty much the same registry key, but no threats were found. Super anti spyware, no homer, no harmful software detected, and Norton Power Eraser scan complete. So, nothing was detected, just a registry key, one or two of those. That was pretty much it. Um, those, like I said, are not big at all. So I'm going to count this as it caught all of them, and that's actually really good. Um, AVG, I actually don't mind the new version of AVG, the 2011 version. It's not as bad as it used to be. Um, the other version, though, I don't know, a long time ago, it used to really, really suck. But it actually isn't as bad now, and you can see it was fully up to date, and it's the free edition. So, if you're looking for a good free antivirus, I would say AVG is not a bad one. 
Um, it's not taking up a lot of RAM. I don't think so, at least. I haven't really looked at this yet. Uh, there are actually a lot of processes right here. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10. So there's 10. So you just add 10 processes to your computer just by installing it. And by the looks of it, you're using about 25, 30K. Not as bad, but like I said, it adds a lot of processes. So that's pretty much that wraps up this review here. Uh, please rate, comment, and subscribe to Zero MXP 95 AV, and please rate and comment on this video. So um, thank you for watching, and please subscribe. Bye.